Well, for the first time, 12 local counties met and assessed data on the causes of traffic fatalities. Engineers, educators, law enforcement, and emergency personnel shared their experiences with traffic deaths to combine their efforts to prevent these tragedies. Hannah Tran met with regional leaders to gather their analysis from their meeting in St. Cloud. Members of the Toward Zero Death Project are used to an annual statewide conference to compare traffic death statistics, but this week several local regions decided to schedule a meeting that's exclusively their own. The East Central workshop for that area and it just gets everyone together to be able to talk about the traffic safety issues that are important for this region. This first of its kind locally focused meeting found specific causes of traffic deaths that are unique in the area. Causes that especially involve impaired driving. And that's young males between the ages of 21 and 29. It's happening on the weekends and it's happening after 8 o'clock and before 4 a.m. in the morning. This week's assessment involves 12 counties. There's eight total towards zero death zones with representatives from each. Leaders from the central and east zones listened to the eyes and ears of the community. Passing on the right is a huge issue, so we've all agreed to really work on that. With less data and a more intimate dialogue on traffic, more issues can be identified. The advantage to narrowing down the focus is to actually look to see what's causing the fatalities in our area. This narrowed approach is new to the team, but they are well adapted to creating campaigns to address those issues. Hannah Tran, Lakeland News. Members of the East and Central regions of Towards Zero Deaths hope to hold a second meeting next year. The statewide Minnesota Towards Zero Deaths Conference will be held in November. If you've enjoyed this segment of Lakeland News, please consider making a tax-deductible contribution to Lakeland Public Television.